Oh wow, he's so tired. So he basically died from spinning? Hey, he's gone. Huh? What the fudge? Huh? What? 80 kilograms of butter? <laughs> Monokuma, I love you. Welcome, Kumas, to another episode of Danganronpa! You're here with Kuma! We've just finished the second class trial, and unfortunately our good friend Mondor died after he killed Chihiro, who just so happened to be a guy. Look on the bright side, at least we didn't lose any cute girls. I mean, come on, we, we gotta look at the bright side sometimes. So let's get right into it! Yes! Hit! I am a little bit excited. Oh, okay, I'm gonna read. I'm a little bit excited because I was just playing those nights at Rachel's. Uh, I think that would have been released by now. But yeah, I just recorded that and I'm a little bit freaked out. So you might notice that my energy levels are a little bit up and down. So please bear with me. <laughs> Get it? Bear? <clears throat> <laughs> I'm reading that. Whoa! I know I shouldn't cry, but I've had enough. That ass. I can't take it anymore. Neither can I. Getting out of here anytime soon? It's impossible. I can't let myself think about how much I want to get out of here. I know. If I keep thinking like that, I might decide to... It's okay. Shh, shh. Kuma won't let anything bad happen to you. Shh, shh. <laughs> donuts! I need to eat some donuts! That'll cheer me up. Oh my god, I, I just remember Monokuma can see all this shit. He can see all the girls in their underwear. You little cheeky bastard. Hey, what the hell is that? She's got all those posters in her room. Drink bottles. What looks to be hand creams, a first aid kit, and she's got a drying rack. What? Wait, is that one of those vibrating things you stand on that kind of works in your glutes, your ass? Wait, are we, are, are we gonna play as Aoi now? Because that'd be pretty cool. Multi-character game and all. Glazed donuts, twisty donuts, jelly donuts, cream filled, donut holes, macadamias. Okay. Oh god of donuts, I'm praying for a wonderful encounter. No, seriously, are we donut girl now? <laughs> I'm sorry. Please forgive me for breaking the nighttime rule, but right now for me donuts are absolutely necessary. Oh yeah, we get a new floor every time we kill someone. Huh? Huh? Wait, why is the background pixelated? Pretty sure I'm playing this game in maximum settings. Huh? What's that sound? Is that like Morse code? Hmm. It sounds like it's coming from the bathhouse. But I'm super scared, but curious at the same time. Is someone there? <gasps> I'm getting better at this voice acting thing. <coughs> oh god, my throat hurts now. I think I just ripped my throat a new one. A next generation legend, stand tall galactic hero. Ooh, that's a good Yoko Gary Sakura. -chan. No, I, that's a. Uh... That's uh, Shiro Gary. He wasn't on the side, I was going backwards. The morning after the conclusion of the second class trial, everyone met up in the dining hall just like always. And I expected it to start like any other day. That's what I expected, but... <sighs> today's count kind of sucks, huh? Toko and Byakuya still refuse to show up. Bow chicka wow wow. Um... And I haven't seen Miss Asahina anywhere. <laughs> she said her stomach was hurting, so she's taking it easy in her room for today. That explains the donuts. It's that time of the month. Oh. That is rather unusual for her. Normally, she's so full of energy. Mm. Which is exactly what makes me worry. So then. So it's just the seven of us then. Yeah. 
And four girls. Ba chicka wow wow. My odds are improving. Oh wait, Asahina's not around. Ah oh, crap, it's 4-4, four, four, isn't it? What, what's the ratio of guys to girls? I forgot. I lost count. We lost Leon, but we lost Sayaka, so that's 1-1. One, one. And now we lost two guys, but we counted one as a girl. So did our ratio of girls go down proportionate to the ratio of guys? Or has it relatively gone down because we assumed Chihiro was a girl? Huh. It looks that way. That? It's times like this where the committee chairman needs to get things going with a bang. Oh wow, he's blue in the face. No, literally, he is blue in the face. Impossible. Or not. I think he's broken. Taka hasn't said a word since everything that happened yesterday. One look at his face showed he hadn't slept a wink last night. It must be because of Mondo. Hey, I haven't slept last night either, but I'm perfectly fine. Oh. The two of them became so close, and then he finds out Mondo killed Chihiro. And then having to watch Mondo get punished, and nothing he could do about it. I can't even imagine what it must have done to him. Wow. So, I mean, what's gonna happen now? We haven't found any way out, and we have no idea if anyone's ever gonna come. <laughs> It's nah, I'm all depressed just thinking about it. Wow, three people blue in the face. It's like someone just wanted to use the color blue as much as they could. <laughs> we simply have to make the best of things, do our best to get along and live here together in peace. I know you're full of shit because I saw you go off not too long ago. You were like, get it for me, piggy, or I shall kill you. So this is what happens when fight or flight mode hits me. I'm like full of energy. Forget about the outside world and accept this new life. That is the only hope we have now. What? To live here forever? Well... Here we have every convenience. We have food, clothes, every need is seen to. Why are you dissatisfied? In fact, let me ask you this. What is it about the outside world that you long for? Yeah, I'm not going to tell you that piece of information, Celeste, because you're going to use it against me. I know you're the manipulating type and playing with your mahjong, but I'm gonna suspect that you're very good at poker too. Is that okay? Competition, discrimination, victimization, and violence. As society grows, so does its perversion. In which case, is our current situation not... <laughs> Demon Angel! Pretty pudgy princess! Huh? Huh? Here we go! Meggie, the drill shop owner, the bunny-eared Amazon, cat curl dog boy, rubber justice the galactic king? And, and, what I mean is, there's no 2D here! <laughs> there is nothing to be done. The mastermind puts such base desire to their advantage, bending you to their will. <laughs> yeah, a bit like you, Celeste. You know? Okay, well, anyway, since Targa's like catatonic as the oldest one here i'm officially stepping up to take the lead i'm sorry but you're the least qualified to be in charge i mean you bought a fucking crystal ball for a million yen that's ten thousand bucks that's like two fucking stupid <sighs> so we're all gonna work together and spend the rest of the day searching the school didn't we do that on like our first and second day here and found absolutely nothing? What's the point of that? Searching? I'm right, right? Well, I mean, since the class trial is over and all, there should be new places for us to investigate. Sakura-chan, whenever you wink and you say something, and I know I've been saying this time and time again, and new places for us to investigate, now it sounds like you want to do a group thing and not just a private, you know, a rendezvous in the gym. Hmm. Yeah, that's the ticket. Maybe we'll find some kind of clue this well time. Then. Well then, once we're done eating, let's split up and begin looking around. Do you have any problem with that, Celeste? <laughs> hmm. There may well be a discovery waiting for us which may further enrich our life here. Um... Uh, no, the point is to look for clues. And just as we started to come together, she barged in and ruined the conversation. I am willing to bet five Kuma coins, it's Toko. Ready? You called for me, so I appear. What the f- 
Oh yeah! She's a serial killer. Yeah, I, I haven't played in about two weeks because I've been barged with uni assignments. And this is like the only day after submitting an assignment yesterday, which I was up 26 hours to do because I had three group members to do six group member assignment. So I kind of forgot what happened. And now I'm reminded that we have a serial killer who somehow extended her tongue. I don't know why, but I like this one a lot better than Toko. You called for me, and so I appeared. Genocide! <gasps> Nobody called for you. Um. <coughs> oh god, I really fucked up my throat. What the? How come it's Genocide Jill and not Toko? Um, like that girl from the original Dragon Ball series, every time she goes, Achoo! Personality changes. Oh wait, it's not when she sneezes, it's when she passes out. Huh. I wonder. Yes! God, this place is just amazing! Finally, a place I can just be my murderous self! No, please, go back to your- You know what? Leave Toko in the box. You stay, I like you. Which is why I've decided to stop holding back and spread my wings! No more hiding in a cave for me! Plus, I have another battle to fight. Oh god, please do not kill me. The whole killer with a split personality thing is so overdone. I gotta destroy that stereotype. You're right, destroy Toko. Let Toko be the alter ego. You me. I'll fight all day and all night to murder those totally slanderous cliches. Did her tongue just grow an extra six inches? But I'm... Uh, um... But you are a killer with a split personality. Ugh, if she weren't here, my chances of survival will go up at least 10%. <laughs> no, mate. <laughs> I'm sorry, Hifu, mate, but she kills cute guys. Your survival has gone up by 10%. Ba chica wow wow. I know, God, I've, I've just been a dick. I'm sorry, Hifu, mate. I am so sorry for taking a shot at you. I feel horrible. No, I don't. You're 2D. Come on, you're gonna back me up here. Even the biggest stars need little people to hold them up. Little people? Did you just make, like, a joke because Nike's short? <laughs> this kill's as fucked up as I am. I'm intrigued. Nike, let's hit on Genocide Jill. Well, whatever else we do today, first we should eat. We can't do anything on an empty stomach. At least she said that without winking. You're right, let's hurry up and eat so we can start our investigation. <laughs> Why do I like this girl? Doesn't make any sense, she's not even my type. So we were forced to eat breakfast with a murderer. And after our much needed but very annoying meal, we set to work looking around the school. Ah, oh, she is a murderer. Oh, it's night time. See, there's trees. Well, I'm not gonna find anything here. Wait, can we get a Mondo's room? He's dead now, right? That's cool. Rattle around. Door won't budge. Why not? Can we get a Chihiro's room? God damn it, I wanted to see what was in their rooms. Hey, that's not pervy. I want to go to the guy's room. Uh, we can't go upstairs. So how the fudge do we... Oh yeah, we gotta keep going this way. Because that stupid teleport thing doesn't work properly. Go on to the second floor. Okay, what the fudge are you doing here? What's that thing around your Could belt? Be? Nothing's changed on this floor. How the fudge are you in charge? It's... We get a new floor. The, the ones we already have don't magically change, you stupid... Oh, God, you're gonna give me a headache. Hmm. The only difference is the gate blocking the stairs leading up to the third floor is gone. Then what the hell are you doing here? I guess that's where they want us to head next. I wonder what crazy stuff is up there. 
then why are you away from the freaking gate? The gate is like this way. You know it's gone, which means why are you back here? The f whatever is an idiot. If he makes it to the goddamn finals of this, huh? If he makes it to the goddamn finals of this thing, I'm gonna be pissed. It's gonna be worse than Survivor. The third floor of Hope Speak Academy. I wonder what we're gonna find this time. What's up here? Or maybe if you stop asking questions and start walking around, you'll find out. Oh, there's a recording room. Wait. If we're looking... Why are we looking this way if we came up the stairs here? Shouldn't we, we be looking this way? What the hell is this? Rec room. Oh, recreational room. I thought it was a recording room. My bad. God, I haven't slept so much. Oh! We get a freaking pool table? Hmm, so this is... The perfect spot to go with Celeste on a date, or oh. Let's see... A recreation room, a place for students to come and relax. I never would have imagined a school having a place like this. You've got a freaking tennis court. You've got a freaking pool. You've got a recording studio. And you, you, you've got a courtroom in the basement. A sauna. And you're surprised that it has a recreation room. I can see why he's the ultimate good luck student. He's not the brightest. <laughs> well, no normal school would. It has Othello, Shogi, and even a dartboard and a bull table. Oh, fuck. Why are my eyes itchy? I didn't eat onion. Why are they itching the more that I rub them? This doesn't make sense. All I had was energy drink. Oh, shit. I might be eating in my eyes! They're back! Ah. Okay. I think my eyes should be okay now because I washed my face, but I think it just might be from lack of sleep. I slept um, yesterday afternoon from 2 p.m. to 11 p.m. So I had more I few hours, but I was up since 11 p.m. and it's now like... 2 p.m. So I've been up for 12 hours. No wait, it's not even 12 hours. It's like 15 hours. And look at this. They have even provided us with a remarkable number of magazines. Isn't it wonderful? Those will certainly be helpful in keeping our boredom at bay. Listen up! Oh my god, it's Monokuma. Please would you stop cock blocking me? Every single time I'm talking to a girl, you cock block me. What's wrong with you, Monokuma? I'm trying to get laid! I mean, I'm trying to get Nigi laid. Awkward. Ring ring, hello there. Allow me to expound. We've got fashion, motorcycles, martial arts, video games, baseball, science, all kind of magazines. Oh, but nothing dirty. This is a school after all. If you need a quick fix, check out the swimsuit mags. So then... And will you be adding to our collection as new issues come out? Too bad! Sorry, no can do. Ha! She's smart. If new issues are coming out, you can keep track of the dates. Even if I wanted to, right now magazines are kinda... Kinda what? Watch out! Whoops. Nothing, never mind. No, no, no. Anyway, that's it for my expoundation. Bye bye! New magazines are what? Did they stop making them? No, that wouldn't happen. Celeste! What he just said. Oh, wait, that's just Celeste. What he just said. I know, right? It bothers me too. Most unfortunate. Life here would be that much nicer if we could add some new issues once in a while. How disappointing. Look, I know you're faking it, but. You've relatively become a lot more attractive ever since the other girls died. Wait, she has that thing on her head. I never noticed she had that thing on her head. Wait, did she add that on today? Was that always on top of her head? Jesus Christ, I never noticed that she's got that main thing on top of her head. I thought she was going for the whole Lolita look. Why does she have that thing on her head? Maybe that's part of the Lolita look. God, see what happens when I don't sleep enough? I start thinking in weird ways. 
I don't know, do you guys like me not sleeping and then recording? If you prefer me not sleeping and then recording, please tell me in the comment section below. If you prefer me wide awake as I usually am, also tell me in the comment section below. Because I will, of course, try to cater for what you guys like as much as humanly possible. But that being said, it's going to take me at least like five or six episodes in order to read the comments of this episode before I actually know the comment because I usually film like a few hours ahead so I can edit and upload, so, you know, bear with me. Really? Okay, Nike. Play it cool. I'm here to help you. There is nothing to be done. It is rather unfortunate about the magazines, but still, I do believe our lives will improve significantly thanks to this little hideaway. So you know she's she likes it here. Okay, so let's just do this quick thing for the coins, right? And there's a table here. It's kind of similar to the desk in the classroom, but also kind of not. You are not the most interesting people. You're not the most interesting type of person. There's a copy of Othello here. I'm pretty bad at it, though. I've never played Othello, but okay. Yay, Kuma coin. 196. Not that we'll really need a lot of them. Unless they give us something new to spend it on, we're going to have all the things we need ever. The pool table is in normal school equipment. Is this thanks to Monokuma? Or did the school buy it? You're going to the most prestigious school in freaking Japan. I'm pretty sure they can afford a freaking pool table. Hey, he's got a Monokuma sign. There's even a dartboard. Did Monokuma put this here? Or was it always part of the school? Stop asking so many irrelevant questions. Let me guess. Did Monokuma buy this? No, he did not buy it. Wait, is this Monokuma branded beer? That would be so sweet. Holy shit, it's Monokuma chess. This looks like the kind of bottle. Wait, this looks like some kind of bottle. But what the heck is it? It's got a Monokuma with a king inside it. That is so freaking cool. Maybe it's just for decoration or something. Dude, I would buy that. I was in Japan, and the only Monokuma shit I could find were t-shirts, and there was only a few of them in the whole of Akihabara. Like, 9 out of 10 stores had no Danganronpa shirts. It was just disappointing. I hope they have new ones when I go later this year, because I'm going in July, and the new anime is coming in June. So I pray to God they have more Danganronpa stuff because I'm going to buy heaps. That being said, I'm going to have to finish DR1, Danganronpa 1, and Danganronpa 2 by the time the new anime comes out. So if worse comes to worse, I'm either going to have to pump out more episodes per week or pump out longer episodes every week. So we'll get a deadline, guys, because I am not spoiling the anime for myself. I'm playing Danganronpa 2, and you guys are going to have Danganronpa 2 before this anime. It doesn't seem especially important right now. I don't need to open it. You're not going to open that freaking thing? What the hell is wrong with you? It's a lamp. Deal with it. I am not even reading the text about the cameras. You should stop being surprised about cameras. Hey, there's a door. Ah, oh, that's to leave the area. Okay, um, let's explore the classrooms first. Let's just explore the entire floor because, you know, let's explore the entire floor. Getting tired of this. What did it say? Pick my nose? What? Is that it? I want more coins. I'm starting to think that these classrooms are just here for the sake of being here to show that there is a classroom. They honestly serve absolutely no purpose besides the fact that they've got coins in them and Sayaka ran to one of them. We haven't used any of them. Despair Squadron Monokuma. Oh god, please do not want to play out your schoolgirl fantasy on me. No, 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 por favor, no, 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 me gu no me gusta. So in the end. Oh no! It's begun! The windows up here are also bordered with metal crates. Not surprising, I suppose. And she's already begun winking at me wearing a school girl. No, Sakura chan, no, I don't, I don't want school girl. I, I, um, uh, Russian Kuma, we, um, no, like school girl. Da? No? Help me. 
So escape still looks impossible. Do not give her ideas! Ugh. But I'd better check all the other metal plates again, just to be sure. And she's probably gonna be like that, lifting it up. So when she does that, her skirt goes up and... Oh yeah, there's a camera. Um, uh, uh, you don't want to be seeing my monocle, my yeah. Wait, does that mean every time I'm in the freaking shower he can see me? Dude, Monokuma! Not cool! You pervy son of a bitch! You know when, um, you know, you've seen Big Brother, right? Or, you know, all those people living in, like, the house together, and the first, you know, week or two, everyone's showering, you know, with their underwear on, and they don't want to show their, you know, parts and whatnot. Everyone's super conservative, you know, uh, whenever they make love, they make love under the sheets, or when they take a shower, you know, they wear swimsuits or something like that. And halfway through the show, they just start making love without any bed sheets. They start taking showers and start walking around naked. <laughs> so it turns into literally a porno. I would, like, if I was invited to a Big Brother, if there was like a YouTube Big Brother, right? If there ever is a YouTube Big Brother, I will be the Kuma. That's like, fuck it. Every week, I'm gonna start undressing more and more. And this may work against me, but hear me out. I will try to dedicate as much time as I can to get fit and, you know, get ripped and all that shit. So that hopefully, people will keep me in the house to see me more and more naked. Because if I'm not physically ripped, they're gonna vote me out to make sure they don't see me naked. That would be my entire strategy. That and trying to keep people entertained as much as possible. And I'm playing Danganronpa, so they'll probably be scared to put me in a house <laughs> with people and knives and all this sort of other stuff. But that would be hilarious. That would be my strategy. What, what else was I going to say? I was going to say something. Like, yeah, I, I would try to be super ripped. Like, that would be so fun. What, what was I gonna say if I was in, if I was in Big Brother? Could you like YouTube Big Brother would be hilarious. Okay, Kyoko, how's it going? Do I notice anything new about her? She's wearing a tie. Wait, what, what's that symbol? She's got it on her tie and she's got it on her shirt. Why am I paying so much attention to what she's wearing? It would seem. So the third floor opened up this time. Were you expecting the fourth floor to open up? After a brief investigation, it looks like there's a physics lab and an art room. <sighs> Did she just sigh? Oh my god, the first time she actually made a sound. I also found a huge machine of some kind in the physics lab. I wonder what it does. Please tell me it's a Tesla coil. Please tell me it's a Tesla coil. Jesus Christ, please tell me it is a Tesla coil. I'm going to the out room right... Oh wait, this is the way to the fourth floor. Huh, cool. Please tell me it's a Tesla coil. That would be so much fun. Oh wow, it's got like a whole physics thing. Tesla coil, come on, come on. That would be so much fun. Oh my god, those piercing red eyes. What's up with me? I don't know. Would you, if you were stuck in this place, who would you, if you had a choice? I won't judge. If you feel uncomfortable to put in the comment section below, you can just message me. Who would you, 